I'm Haley, and I'm here with your Google Top Search of the Week. As many of you heard, actor James Franco got into a little bit of hot water this week when he allegedly tried to pick up on a 17-year-old girl, who he met outside the Broadway showing of his play of Mice and Men. Mr. Franco is being filmed, of course, when he says to Lucy Claude, tag me. So she did. That's where things get a little bit weird. Who are you with? Do you have a BF? Nearly 18. My mom. And not if you're around. When is your B-Day? Where are you staying? What's your number? In May, but I have exams then. Just off of Times Square in a Hilton. What do you mean by number? Following a couple more suggestions to meet somewhere else, private, Lucy then has second thoughts if this is really James Franco or is she being played? Mm. She texts, this is a story my Scottish friends will never believe. Don't tell. I just want proper evidence that it's you and I won't. I gave it to you. And if you don't want to meet, then text me when you do. Bye. You sound so dodgy though. Bye. One second. I will meet you if you write my name on a piece of paper, then send it to me with your face in the picture, please. To which he responded with this. The next day, James went on the Live with Kelly and Michael show to proclaim his innocence. Come on, James. You are James mother Franco. You have a list of lovers that would make George Clooney jealous. Marla Sokolov, Sienna Miller, Seth Rogen. Trying to hook up with a 17 year old is kind of sad. Doug Hutchison marrying Courtney Stodden sad. Hugh Hefner dating anyone sad. Now this may just be a misunderstanding between a 35 year old man and a 17 year old girl, but I thought to myself, the timing is just a little bit sketch. There's no way that it could all just be a publicity stunt for Palo Alto. You know, that dark drama centered on a group of teens with a penchant for finding trouble. I don't know, boredom breakers. Tell me what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and like. I'm Haley, and I will see you next time.